Apple have recently released a new feature on the iPhone which allows you to quickly and easily remove the background from your photos. So what is this feature and how does it work? That is what we are going to be talking about in this video. Let's get started. subject using this new feature you are erasing the background and making everything around the cutout transparent you then save this as a new png file which is a type of file which allows for transparent backgrounds you can cut out images from all types of image files, including JPEGs, RAW files, portraits, live photos, videos, and more. For the best results, there should be an obvious separation between the subject and the background. If the image is blurry, then you're probably not going to be able to cut anything out. This feature is available in many apps, including Photos, Messenger, and Safari. This feature is only available on iOS 16 and for devices with an A12 Bionic chip. So if you have an iPhone or an iPad from after 2018, then you are probably going to be able to access this feature. Older iPhones, iPads and Android devices are not going to be able to access this feature. There are a few different ways to use this feature. The first is to copy an object. To do this, open your image in Photos, which I'm using here. Then quite simply touch and hold the image that you want to cut out. Release your hold when you see a glowing line around the edge of your object. A copy share menu will appear. Simply tap the copy to save the image to your clipboard. You can open a, another app such as Messenger and you can paste your image in there. So let's do that again, but this time we're going to use the share option in the menu. So again, open your image in photos, touch and hold the object until you get a glow around the edge. Release your hold when you see the glowing line around the edge of your object and touch the share button this time to open the sharing menu. Now I can choose which app I want to share this into. You can also drag and drop your image to another app. So again, open your image in photos, touch and hold the object that you want to cut out, but this time don't let go when you see the glowing line. Instead, drag the object away from the original position until the cutout shrinks. Then use a second finger to open another app and you can drag and drop your image into the other app. Okay, so you found a photo in Safari that you want to cut out. Now this works slightly different than it does in Photos. You can do this on any page in Safari, and no matter how many photos are on that page. Just tap and hold on the image that you want to cut out. You'll get a menu and just tap copy subject to save the object to your clipboard. Then just open another app and paste the object in there. I hope that you have found this video useful and can now start cutting out your objects quickly and easily. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again next week. Bye bye.